Hey guys, welcome back to program up and today in this episode we're gonna talk about an issue that we have seen recently into the MacBooks with the M1 Max processor. So some of the MacBooks with the M1 Max processor have shown a significant drain into the battery when the GPU was not even been utilized. So let me come to the topic exactly. So as you might be knowing that the M1 Pro and the M1 Max processor has got a major difference into the GPU cores. So there's twice amount of GPU cores in the M1 Max processor that's exactly to be 32 cores whereas the M1 Pro has got 16 cores of GPU. So due to the 32 cores in the M1 Max processor we have got to see some battery drain issues and that's right now available and even Verge sees the same thing. Even though if you do not use the GPU cores for any of the tasks you can see a battery drain. So that's a major issue what we are getting to see right now and might this this might be fixed into the near future with some software updates as well but right now we are getting to see this issue now the question that arises over here is that what would i recommend if there's an issue into the battery with the m1 max processor so what would i recommend to you whether you should be going with the m1 max processor or with the m1 pro processor what should i recommend to you now my recommendation here would be understand your need and utilization if you're just choosing m1 max for the reason because it's a higher performance processor and it can, it can provide you much more gpu performance and you do not need it right now for some near future you're just planning in and for that purpose you're choosing to go with the m1 max processor so clearly i won't recommend it to you because if you're not going to use that it's completely a useless entity for you because that's going to cost you in terms of battery drain. So battery is going to drain out if you're not going to even use it. So a machine that costs some hefty and massive amounts of investment. And at the end of the day, you do not get the complete and the rightful battery capacity and battery utilization. So it's of no use to you. For example, if you're a video creator or let's say you're a person who needs a lot of GPU power. And when you try to use that uh, continuously for three to four hours five hours and the battery drains out completely so that's okay fine at, at one moment of time at least you're using it for something and that's costing you though so much amount of battery drain so in that case it's right but if you're not going to use it and it costs you the complete battery drain so that's not rightful thing to do so understanding your need why do you need it and if you need it or not so that's a major thing over here so if you do not need so much of GPU power and by the way what I can say from my perspective and my experience that 16 cores of GPU is just enough for video editing or for video creators all. So if you're a video creator and if you're a person who needs GPU for some tasks and some softwares so the 16 cores of GPU is also really great. So you can go along with the M1 Pro and this can provide you much more better performance for the battery as well. Because we have tried to test this machine for battery performance and what we have got onto the best side was all around 18 hours, 19 hours of battery if I just trying to use it for internet and everything. And if I'm using it for heavy tasks, I can easily get 7 to 8 hours of a battery onto a completely heavy load of tasks. And for and onto the normal basis, what I use it for, so I use it for content creation. I use it for video editing and I use it for programming. So when I'm doing everything, all my normal tasks completely, so the battery just lasts for around more than 14 hours and that's really great over here. So that's the reason why I would be recommending you to go along with the M1 Pro processor. If not, you need a high capacity of a GPU processor. So if you do not need that, do not go along with that because that can cause you some battery drain issues into it. So guys, this is my complete review about this topic and thoughts on this matter and if you've got any more questions please leave that down into the comment sections below if you liked our video please hit that like button subscribe to our channel meet you in the next episode till then goodbye